Joining me now from Milestone is Malu. Um, Malu, welcome. I hear you're new on board here as part of the team. Um, that's an exciting opportunity for you this year. Maybe you can tell us a little bit about the company and the work that you're doing here. Yes. <clears throat> My name is Malu Toft. I'm the VP for Milestone for EMEA region. And we're here this year to celebrate that for the 10th year in a row, we have been ranked as the number one VMS developer in the world. And I mean, that's a, a huge attribute in itself. You must be incredibly proud to be joining that team of, of uh, select specialists in this, in this area. Yes, it's extremely exciting. I come from a long-standing career in telecoms. Yeah. Um, so I've been watching, you know, smart cities and, and um, smart municipalities evolve with connected, connecting things. Um, now moving into the video technology space is extremely exciting because this is really where we can start to see the bridging between AI and IoT and how these things are moving really, really fast. And what are you most excited about this year? Maybe within the company, there are specific products that you're really excited to show everyone out there? Well, there's a lot of things to be excited about this year. First of all, one of the big themes for us is high performance. Um, we can see that many of our customers are really looking into how can they do more with less, mm -hmm. how can they improve their efficiency. And behind us here, we actually are showcasing uh, running live 2,000 live streams in one server, which is actually quite an achievement. And it all comes down to these kind of cards um, where we actually are accelerating the hardware performance mm. in a way that is actually unheard of. So the companies, in the end, can do much, much more with less service, less hardware, and th this will affect their total cost of ownership. It affects the, the need for maintenance, and it really drives down the cost. And in a world where technology is moving ahead really fast, it's also really important for us to support the need to have operational efficiency and to help the customers save money. What other trends do you see out there in the market at the moment? Um, I guess other little areas, little niche holes that you can that you can focus on as a company. Well, there are certainly themes out there that are driving the innovation. I think this year at IFSEC, we're not really going to be able to to uh, get around uh, the cybersecurity, which is uh, on everyone's lips. Also, given that we have just been introduced to new regulation on data privacy, etc. So this is something that is highly important to ensure that the software that is being developed in a responsible way can really take the customers and the companies where they want to go and still being secure and safe about their data. Um, another theme could be the uh, analytics. Um, the way we are using video footage now will be massively changed over time. We are seeing, we are, we're seeing so many of our partners in our community that are developing new plugins, new features to go along with the Milestone X Protect. And this is really proving to be what is moving the needle uh, in terms of robotics, machine learning. You can, you can definitely tell where a, where a person might be going, where they are coming from, and you could also even enhance to predict what, what will happen uh, just by, by analyzing the video in a, in a closer way. To that end, then, what do you think the, the future of the market is? What, what trends might we see in the future? What, what are we looking at in maybe a year's time, two years' time? What, what, how far can this go? I think it's really difficult to predict, of course, because you know we think things have never gone faster than now, but we also know that they will never go slower than right now. But I think the whole entrance now on, of AI and how the different types of augmentation you know, really, really thick or big data analytics are going to really change the way we can make decisions. That is definitely going to rampage and accelerate throughout. And I believe that when we see AI as being something we are looking at with, with care in a way, I think video can really help to take us there in a way that us as human beings can still follow it. Because the video can give us the kind of documentation and and uh, legitimacy in, in believing what, what our cameras are basically telling us. 
So I think this is really going to be an important bridge for us to be moving into IoT and to take all of this intelligence with us. Well, thank you very much for speaking to us. Welcome officially to the team yeah. at Marston. I know it's going to be an exciting year for you. I'm so excited to be here. Yeah. So we'll have a, some great days. Great. Have a, have a fantastic time. Thank you. Thank you.